Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of the Modern Minecraft Modded Adventure. I said modded twice, but it doesn't matter. Welcome back, guys. Welcome back. Today, we are doing what I told you guys we were going to do last episode, and that is going to the Twilight Forest. So, uh, I forgot a bucket. Okay, I got my bucket, guys. Okay, so let me explain what we're going to be doing. Of course, most of you guys will probably know what it is. The Twilight Forest is a very, uh, it's not easy. Uh, it'll be very fun to go in there. With every like level being changed, so I'm very curious to see. All right, so I got a new sword here, so yeah. All right, so I got a new sword here, which is fantastic right here. I uh, put shadow, uh, dark shadows, and then breaking three. <coughs> I was also working on a piece of armor, uh, but we'll get that later because I have not completed the actual enchantments I want on it. Um, so it is technically not done yet. So here we are. So basically all you gotta do is put these things, uh, the flowers around it and uh, throw a diamond in it and uh, I believe a boom. Whoa, whoa. Wishing you off to the Twilight Forest. Oh my god, there's so much stuff here. This is the first time I go to the Twilight Forest in this game, so I'm getting all these uh, advancements now. <laughs> my, my. Whoa, what a interesting, oh my god. Yes, the trees are very big. Alright, let's go back and see uh, if I actually spawn back home. I'd like to see if I spawn back home. Yes, there you go. Gonna put that right there, just just for the hell of it, right there. Yeah, go. Okay, so let us go in, guys, into the twilight forest we go, and hoping I don't die right away. So I wish I had a map uh, to the actual, uh, you know, thing. But uh, you know, I should probably make an atlas one, to be honest. Uh, atlas, there you go. Compass in the book. All right, guys, I'll be back. Here we are, guys. Again, once again, I have the uh, this beauty right here, which is for the uh, other world, and then this one right here is going to be for the uh, twilight. So, whoa, that's crazy. Okay, so that's cool. Okay, so now we have something to go for. So, what way should I go? And by the way, I did make this beautiful giant bow string longbow. In the last, uh, well not the last episode, but between episodes, uh, it took me a while. Thankfully I have the bone farm, that, not skeleton farm, which gives me a bunch of arrows. Uh, this is just a few of what I have and then some really cool ones here. So um, let's move on. I don't know what way to go, but let's see. Uh, let's go north. So I guess north is that way. Okay, let's go north. Yeah, I guess. You know, there's some really cool bosses here that I'd love to find, like the Naga. It's really cool, and they got these really nice uh, lights here. Uh, these little plants. Right here. And yeah. yeah, these lights, the fireflies, are going to be really cool to have. So, uh, what way was I going? Away? All right, I was going this way. Hopefully I can find something interesting here. It's very hard to see, because the trees are everywhere. It's literally a giant... Twilight Forest, which is really amazing. Whoa. What is this? Is it, can I see this on the thing? No. Okay, nice. Uh, obsidian. And there's a thing on top. Okay. Oh my god! What the heck? That just came out of nowhere. Oh my god, anyways, this beautiful thing right here, I'd love to get mending on it. This has mending, but I haven't gotten another mending for the sword. Oh my god, do you see that over there? Because I do. Yeah, yeah. Forgot I can do sneak attacks, which is really cool. This is going to be a really cool thing to do is sneak attacks. So that's one thing I'm going to love to do. Okay. These 
interesting mixture when I just I love the noise of this thing Kate. it's just so cool. If you guys have any ideas of what I could build with that, that'd be great. You guys can also have some really good ideas, so. The music is amazing. Oh my god, I gotta raise that music up. Oh, oh god. I wasn't paying attention, but I found I found something over there. Is that a battle tower or no? Okay, so it does seem like it was it is a battle tower, so I'm not interested in battle towers. I'm more interested in uh, actually finding some uh, other types of towers that you can find in the Twilight Forest. Okay, so I'm gonna sneak up behind this guy. Oh, hello. Oh, nope. Guess I killed him. Oh no, is the forest burning over here? <gasps> no. Oh, it's a dragon! No wonder. the dragon all right oh no oh no it's got me in its freaking thing again it's got me in its clutches guys all right so all I got I had to do was log in and log back out so there we go boom too bad I can't really save the forest because uh, everything's gonna burn because the dragon was here so we're just gonna we're just gonna continue onward in hopes that we can find something more interesting than just a uh, oh I found something oh I think this is one of those places um I think maybe goblins live in there or was it cobalts or something like that these are some nice things here oh my god. Can I pick him up? Yes! Wow, this place is beautiful! It's like... So nice! I could stay here all day! Imagine making a base here, that'd be cool. But anyways, is this a dragon's den? Now that I think about it, I think it is a dragon's den. It is. Maybe we can redeem ourselves from that last time. Did I just hear that? Or is that just me? It's a level 5 dragon right there. Oh yeah, that's definitely a level 5 dragon right there. Yeah, that's right. This is how I'm going to beat the dragon. Oh, I beat it already. Nice. Okay, so... I'm not, I'm not going to make a mistake this time. I'm going to make sure there's light in here. Lagging a little bit. It's to be expected though. I didn't bring any torches. Of course I didn't. Okay, so let me uh, put you down there. See, at least there's some fireflies in here, so... Okay, 
Okay. Trying to survive here. Okay. This place is absolutely empty, which is fine with me. The good thing is, there's not a lot of zombies in here. Alright, so let's see what we got. No, uh, no dragon egg yet. But, oh, wow, I have a lot of these, uh, things here. Okay, I got a lot of bones again. I got some dirt I don't need. That was a stage 5 dragon as well, so that's, that's interesting. Still no eggs though. I'm hoping I can get a dragon again so I can actually grow my, uh, have my own, uh, have my own dragon one day I can ride. And look, are those reindeers? Those are wild deer. Okay, wild deer. Nice. Okay, so, uh, we're gonna move on. Continue moving on forward. Let's get the, this. There you go. Because I want these. Oh, we found something over here. It's not a castle, but it's something. Ah, it's a, uh, it's one of those dungeons. Right? Whoa, oh no, th no, this is definitely the, the, the Twilight one. Let me, uh, let me heal. Let me actually definitely heal. Definitely heal. Okay. Oh, the spawner's up there. Okay, well, I gotta break that spawner. There we go. Chest in there with a bunch of potatoes and uh, stuff. Uh, torch berries. Ooh. Uh, I have a bunch of bones at home and a lot of dragon bones. Dragon bones. I definitely don't need to charge stuff as well. Definitely, I can take the chicken. That'll be good. The potatoes are gonna be good to take. A charm of keeping. Ooh, what is this? Bobble Emmy. That's interesting. Uh, let's see what else. I can take some fish because I do have some fish in me. Uh, melon seeds. I already have. I have plenty of that stuff. I don't need this stuff, especially the hearts. I already have the hearts at home. Uh, and uh, definitely no plants either. I'll take these though. I'm very curious about the those, and then I want to get the green armor for the dragon. So I'll take that with me, of course, and then I'll put that on there. Because wow, that took a lot of stuff out, out of me. It's intense. What? Okay, so apparently that was like a druid. <gasps> yes, we found this place, the Naga one. I can fight the Naga. Hopefully I can win. That'd be great. And there's a dragon thing in, in there too. Interesting. So let's let's see if we can fight the Naga. Oh yeah. Hello Naga. A level 56 Naga? Oh my lord. How much damage can I take from this thing? Oh no. This battle is very, uh, interesting. Okay, so far it's taking a good amount of damage. I'm gonna go in there and fight it. It'd be even better if it had, like, some really cool battle music. That'd be really cool. But, uh, here comes the Naga. I'm gonna take it down. So far doing so good. I'm, I'm doing good so far. Okay, not bad, not bad. Gotta avoid the head. The head is the thing that damages me the most, of course. Oh shoot, it just shot out like that. It's almost dead, which is good. Almost dead. We do the sneak, sneak attack. It does a lot more. Oh yeah, we defeated it. Heck yeah. That is crazy. I got the Naga Trophy. That's awesome. Yes. Increase maximum health. Heck yeah. 
Yeah, all right, that's awesome. Not bad. I really like the decoration in this area, this battlefield. It's really cool, and then honestly, this would really be a really cool place to live in. Not the Naga place, but the Twilight Forest definitely has some really cool stuff. Uh, there's another Dragon's Den there we can check out. We can do that as well. I don't know why this was broke. All oh, right, because I forgot Naga to break stuff. Um, I'm just gonna throw this stuff away because I honestly don't need it. Uh, yeah, do not need any of this. I'm still trying to figure out what this is. Bubbles keeping. I don't know what it does though. Okay, well I'll uh, keep it there. Definitely can break this uh, and see what kind of dragon we we're trying to look into. It's a level four dragon, not big. I don't see an egg yet. Definitely take these things down. The dragon has freaking cloaking on it. Or is that something else I saw? Yeah, dragon is dead. Phoenix, Storm, Poison, Very Vengeance. Oh shoot, oh my god. These monsters are going to be so annoying to beat. I don't see an egg though. Usually, I think it's the, the level 4 or 5 should have eggs, right? Is it, or, or is it just the 5? Because I would love to go down there and check it out. But look at all these things, those, those evil looking things are evil. Now, let me actually open up the top so I can actually... Ooh, some diamonds. Uh, so I can actually... Um, there you go. I could have fallen in there not knowing about it either. Alright, come on guys. You know you guys want to come and die in my hands. Let's go. All zombies in deck. There you go. Okay, so then I got the, these little things. They're so annoying. I can't, I can't even hit it. Why? There we go. Ouch, 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 ouch. Okay, look. Where the heck is the other one? I don't see the other one. Oh, there, it's Cobalt, yeah. Yeah, I think that was a mistake. I think they were nice people. I don't know if they were nice or not. But, uh. Oh my god, where's the skeleton? Let's, uh, let's start getting this dragon in hopes of it having an egg. I don't think it. That's where it was. There we go. Anyways, let's continue on by actually getting this thing and. Uh... Right, I forgot. Red one, I don't really need the red one. But, uh, any egg? No egg. Doesn't have an. Oh my god! Alright. So, no egg, meaning, oh, there are some diamonds, though. I'll take those. I'm just gonna go cut through this. In hopes of finding a really cool tower or something. Whoa, gotta be careful not to fall down there. Here we are. So far, nothing interesting. Just a lot of drops.
I know sometimes underground there are places that have like cobalt homes and stuff, I believe. But they're very specific little dome looking areas. So once I look at those, I think there's also a minotaur, um, a minotaur maze somewhere underground. We can check that out as well. There's some really cool stuff we can find in Twilight Forest. There's just a lot to explore with this uh, mob. Which is really cool. Um, I'm definitely looking forward to the uh, tower though. Because I know you can fight the Lick. The Licked Lord or something like that. The Lich. Yeah, they got the Lich. That's what it's called. The Lich. Um. But so far, I haven't found it. I found it. I found the castle. That's awesome. Yes. I need to eat, though. Okay. So I found the castle, which is a good thing. That is awesome because now we can actually go up a bit. Oh, we can actually climb it. Wow, what in... Whoa, this is the coolest freaking tower I've ever seen. Guarded by a dragon. And it's a tower. Oh, good lord. This is a really cool thing to find. This is... Oh, God. That's, that kind of scared me. I'm going to look at you in the eyes. There you go. That was loud, actually. So, there's a dragon. And on top of the dragon's den... There's a tower, which is really cool because that that right there is so freaking cool. Look at that. Now that is something you'll see over there. And I like how it blends in with the tower too. So like you can see right here the tower right there blends in with that. I wonder how it looks on the inside. I'm very curious. But guys, I'm going to leave that up to the next episode because this whole thing is going to take a while. And I, I feel like that next episode is worthy of this tower just in itself which is really cool so uh guys thank you guys for watching oh what is that is that bones they are bones wow and there's even freaking dragon bones here what <laughs> this is the best location ever i've seen so far that's cool so i'm definitely gonna go back home and recharge some stuff you know get things together but i am gonna have to put this in the map i'm not gonna forget about this one and the cool thing is that we do have a little tower thing here, so let me put, uh, I'm gonna put it, call it the Dragon Lick Tower. I'm pretty sure I misspelled that, but hey, it's cool, the Dragon Lich Tower right there, and it's that far away from us. So Naga Maze is right here, and between that, uh, the Dragon Lich Tower and our home portal, which is awesome. So, uh, guys, thank you guys for watching today's episode. Of the modded Minecraft adventure. Oh my god, that was weird. Um, and, uh, wow, that is. For some reason, I thought that was much taller. But, guys, thank you guys for watching today's video. I am very excited to start the Twilight Forest, which is something I've been wanting to start since the beginning of the series. But now we are actually really strong, which is good. We're not going to die here right away. That's a good thing. But, I wonder what level the Lich Lord is going to be at. He, he might be higher or lower than the Naga we fought, but I don't think that's going to cause a problem, though, because the Naga was level 50-something, and uh, I was 55, so I'm fine. Uh, but that's good. Uh, but yeah, guys, like, subscribe. Uh, okay, that was music. I was like, what is that? <laughs> Anyways, guys, like. Subscribe and definitely share. Uh, we I want more people in the community to see these videos. I really enjoy making them. So if we can have more people to join the community and uh, we can grow as one, then I think we can really succeed in uh well you know in the channel. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe. And if you do subscribe, hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I do upload a new video. So I'll see you guys.